Hey guys, good evening and welcome to my channel where we're discussing Mandela effects of the like. Thank you for joining in tonight, guys. Welcome all Mandela effects. Hey guys. Um, so anyway, um, I'm interviewing Teresa. She's, she said she went up to a Walmart employee. Check this out. She, she found residue on the back of his hat um, where Walmart actually still has the left side of the T. What I'm wondering is when did they lose that left side of the T? Look at this. You can tell from the embroidery that that R is either way too long or, or there's a break in there. Let me see if I can zoom in. I can't zoom in anymore. Okay, but you can definitely see where the R should be cut off right there. And here is the left half of that T still there in the embroidery. So they, whoever is doing this to us has failed to cover this one up. And look, let me tr let me trace it for you here. I got Teresa on the phone. She, this is not a Photoshop, okay? Uh, unlike that last one with the J.C. Penny, that one I am really sorry for that one because um, that one's been debunked, okay? This one here is not a Photoshop. This is the real thing. You guys see real. that T? Okay, Teresa, you want to explain your story? Yes, I went over to get groceries today earlier today in Walmart, probably around probably around twelve thirty one o'clock. And I proceeded to go to the produce section to get some oranges. And there was an employee standing there, and I approached him, and I asked him if I could look at his um, badge to see how Walmart looked. And, of course, that one had changed. And I said, can I see the back of your hat? And he goes, oh, sure, no problem. And when I turned, when I went to bear on the back of him, I seen that it was correct. And I said, you realize that this is the way it's supposed to be? I said, can I take a picture of it? And he goes, he goes yeah, sure, why not? I took a picture, he took his hat off and looked at it, and I said, is that the way that you remember? And he goes, yes, 100%. He said, all my badge is incorrect. He said, there's always been a full T, not a half a T. Yeah. And he let me take a picture of his hat, and I did. And and uh, I'm told, uh, this is like, wow, that I have this. This is not, not changed yet. This is not, so. so um, this is real. This is not Photoshop. I'm, I'm wondering. My camera on my phone. Okay. My did you notice phone. anyone when you were there? Did you notice anyone anyone else's hats the same way? No, I didn't because I was kind of afraid to poach any more people. <laughs> <laughs> did you did you did you manage to wake them up to the Mandela effect? Yes, he was like shocked. I I said, "How long you been with the company?" And he goes, "A he goes a long time." And he goes, "Wow." He goes, "The look has never changed." And I said, "I said, do you know anything about love has changed?" He's like, "No." And he said that that tea is not supposed to be like that. Okay. A half a tea, it's supposed to be like what's on his hat. Yeah, I did a video earlier, uh, and I'll I'll actually be making a link to that other video about the Walmart. Um, I, I wasn't yeah. the first one to see that one. Um, by the way, I want to mention also uh, not only Teresa Lynch, but um, I want to mention a special shout out goes to MS Eman for finding that one. I'll, I'll post a, a link to his video channel. Again, we're, we're just here to talk things, okay? We're here to talk things out. The Mandela Effect is meant to connect our memories. Something's going on. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry, guys. Um, these, my videos are uncut and unedited, and I'm sorry about that. I, you know, I, I just managed to sneeze. Sorry about that. But anyway, um, Walmart has um, apparently there's residue on some, on some of these guys' embroidered hats. So yes. whoever is behind this has failed to cover up. And uh, that's the They're end of my... not cleaning up very good, are they? <laughs> <laughs> no, apparently not. But anyway, guys, thanks for checking me out. Have a great Mandela effect night, and God bless you all.